They laid hands on Jesus, marched him through the streets of the city, and carried him in a hall called Calvary. They forced him to carry his cross. When Jesus was pierced in the side and nailed to the cross, after they had stripped him of his raw garment and gambled for it, he made seven striking utterances from the cross and finally said, My God, my God, why hast thou forsaken me? And heaven could not stand it. Divinity stepped out to expose human audacity. God frowned in anger, and the earth became dark. People were carrying lanterns at noonday. God drew a sign of divine indignation, and people asked, did you ever hear such thunder? He began to bat his eye on the bosom of his angry face, and people said, just look, how is lightning out here? With the stroke of his omnipotence, God fanned out nature's daylight and caused man's daytime to turn to night. The son of nature saw the son of God on the cross and refused to shine, as if two suns could not shine at the same time. The stars fell from their orbits, the moon took a judgment hemorrhage and went away in blood. The earth shook. The graves opened and the dead marched down the street asking, what is the matter? Somebody said, Jesus is dying. The veil of the temple was torn from top to bottom and the centurion cried out, truly this must be the Son of God. Finally, they took him down from the cross and placed him in a borrowed tomb and buried him in a borrowed grave. But somewhere late Saturday night and early Sunday morning, he arose. <laughs> And he died On the cross Just to say A sin sick And the Lord But he rose Yes, he rose One Sunday morning Said a word Nothing but the sound Of the hammer ringing In his flesh Was ever heard But even through all of that <laughs> He rose Oh, 
Oh 